welcome to Rome Total War, the Slave Revolt, Part 1. Sexy Battles, Jim here. Well, as you can see, uh, very hard, very hard, but there's no time limit trigger in here. So, that being said, Slave Revolt. Haha. -ha. Okay, um, how do you find your capital in such a place? No family tree. Okay, let's see here what do we have on finances. Finances, projected profits, minus 6320. Okay, well that looks brilliant. Um, well look at this, we're spread all over hell. Well, this is a cheery place. No buildings. No prospect of building buildings, maybe? Putting something together? Okay, this is loony. Everything is negative. Negative. Oh, look at that. 28. Hey, there's some money there. We could run the empire from right here. Okay, negative. Okay. Well, I don't think we're going to make too much money on the next turn. Let's see what we have over here. Not so bad, only minus 75. What kind of troops do we have? Nothing. These guys, militia. Hey, a cavalry unit, barbarian. I thought you were supposed to have some sort of, um, gladiators or something. <laughs> Just a bunch of Gomer Pyle regular guys here. Pirates, so we're getting closer. <laughs> okay, well, I'm going to go ahead and, um, take a look at this here. what this does for this region. Aha! Uh-huh. Financial balance, cultural, oh, military. Okay, now you see, here's a little trick. What I'm planning on doing <laughs> is, uh, where are these guys? Ah, oh, here we are. Stripping these guys out of here. And go ahead and abandon ship on everything that isn't making any money at all. Disband as many units as we can. And try to dig in, into, dig in at Byzantium. Maybe we can make a go of it from here because we do have cities now that are making some money. And they're relatively close by. Hell, even this place is making a few bucks and has some defenders. So, if you if you were to strip everything down, all around the empire, just down to this little area in here, it might be possible to make a run of it and uh, see what happens. Okay, so that's what I'm going to do here. Um, I'm going to try to prosecute uh, the war from here. Maybe I can hold on to some stuff over here. There looks like uh, there's some money still being generated here and here. So, okay. Maybe here. So I'm going to try to analyze the situation, see what I can hold on to, what I can abandon, how many troops I can uh, sack out. <coughs> Excuse me, sorry about that. There might be some hope here for the um, barbarian world. But I'm curious about um, family tree and um, who's going to be in charge of what. I don't think I'm going to have a, anybody in charge of anything. Um, if I can build some diplomats over here, maybe I can bribe an enemy general. 
Yeah, okay, there's a possibility. All right, there's some hope here um, for this campaign. If we try to start it from here. I don't know about down here. I really don't. Well, we'll, we'll get back to all this stuff. Okay, this will be um, the first segment of Turn 1, Slave Revolt. Um, very hard, very hard level. Okay, well, here we go. Well, these Romans are knocking at the door here. They just uh, decided to come across the pond and get me. Looks like my relief army, what little there is, is going to be a bit late. Um, these guys have siege equipment and much bigger and better troops than anything I have in here. Uh, yeah. Okay, we're going to go back to the other side of the world. And we're going to go ahead and auto fight this. So I have pretty good odds, but I bet you're gonna knock the liver out of my peasants. Oh wow, I'm surprised as heck. Look at that, that's something new. Okay, well maybe that's portents of things to come. Okay, we'll get rid of all these guys because uh it's just the way it is. And um military build going back to financial and repair barracks. Maybe. We'll see. Huh, I can't believe we're going to make some profits for once. We've been losing money for the last uh, couple turns real bad. Okay. We take a look at the um, diplomacy. This is going to be something. You see all my... <laughs> I've uh, ran away from every battle. That's all I could do over here. These guys I had to skedaddle. Up here I had a force of um, some infantry and uh, some light horse and whatnot. And these are catapracts and uh, horse archers. And they just mowed me down. I didn't have a chance. Not a chance. Um, so I'm going to try to consolidate over here. Need to get him out of their territory. Try to get him across this ford back this way because there's a bunch of bad guys blocking the way over here. So it's good that we took this. Um, I guess we should try to go ahead and immediately march down here toward this ford and try to get into this area as quick as possible. So let's go ahead and do that. about the Egyptians over here. Um, that doesn't mean anything. There's probably a big army lurking around. I don't have time to wait around and hold anything, um, really, since everything is in such bad shape. And I've tried to, to let the enemy just walk into these towns here. Hopefully they will um, get rid of some of the cost of running them. Um, what we're really trying to do is hold on over here. We made the Byzantium our capital. We have, we built a port, it was the necessity of a lifetime, had to have that. And uh, so we could have some commu communication between our main little settlement here, this area. I decided I was going to try to control this because there is some money being made here and here and here. And up here. Okay, up here there's the Scythians are chasing me around. So I'm going to try to consolidate on the neck of this peninsula here. Get these guys down here. They've been chased all over the place by a bunch of Scythians. I thought about going in this direction, but I got pushed back, so I figured best to come down here and defend this town. It's still making money. Back over here, by Greece. Um, <laughs> I tried to pull my troops out of uh, out of Athens. I had a ship. I loaded them on there. I figured I could swing them around up here before I could get anywhere. These guys showed up and promptly sank me, and that was the end of my troops from Athens. Nobody just came to conquer Athens. I wonder why. This is a very strange, um, very strange uh, campaign. Um, and I believe the Romans are going to come march in here on the next turn and get me. Uh, I think I pointed that out already. Um, I had 
had some conscript units over here. They chased them off and then killed them. They disappear out, well, apparently on this, in this campaign, um, some of your units will just appear out of nowhere. Happened on the last turn over here. Um, these guys just appeared here and here. So I'm going to try to march them back out here toward Segestia, which I abandoned on turn one and hasn't been captured by the Romans. I wonder why they will not take these places. They're free. It's um, a puzzle. So we'll go ahead um, and try to transport these guys over here. We'll move them over here toward this town. I need to try to um, consolidate as much as possible. I have very few structures. The only place that really has anything is over there in um, uh, Byzantium. You can see, um, first I was being chased around by these guys. And then Pontus landed a bunch of uh, characters. And I don't believe that diplomats are going to do me any good at all. Because it won't even allow me to talk to an enemy um, uh, guy here. There's no, no list of things to say. It won't even allow me to talk to him. I can't ask him for trade rights, to see Spire, um, to, to eat tomatoes. You know, and, uh, um, oh yeah, here you, here you go. You, you think that Numidia is tough? This, this is on the hard, hard level too, like Numidia campaign. Take a look at this. <laughs> Here's my friends. Oh boy. The whole world wants to snuff me out, man. So, um, yeah. We'll see how far I can get in this. Numidia is, is a cakewalk compared to this campaign. Um, so we'll see what happens on the next turn here. Uh, if I make any money, if I continue to generate some bread, or if I continue to fall apart and am doomed to financial uh, self-destruction because the computer keeps giving me troops I don't want and I can't disband them are too far away from any territory I control. So uh, we'll see what happens here in uh, just a few minutes. And get these guys down here if that's possible. A miserable little troop. And um, yeah. I do have one, one ace in the hole way up here. Uh, these guys. If I can get these guys into the action. These are, these are pretty cool troops here, these Amazon chariots, and they're all experienced too. If I can get them somewhere near my territory before I A, run out of money, or B, get totally destroyed, you might be able to help in the ensuing um, campaign. Well, as you can see, the Romans have attacked, and I'm going to get annihilated, it looks like, two to five. They have all these lovely, heavy, big, heavy troops. Look at that. Oh yeah. Okay. Um, I have <laughs> militia, um, some mercenaries, Sicilian pirates, some more militia, peasants. So here we go. I guess I'm gonna. Wow. Maybe I'll set up in the in the square and try to hold out as long as possible. Darn it.
Thought we left somebody behind. Okay, let's let him come get me. Go ahead and fast forward this till they get right down here. Shouldn't take them too awful long to come to kill me. Oh well. Well, here they come. As soon as we see some fire, and we'll slow it down. breaking through. My men are gallantly, gallantly holding on here to the last, you slob Romans. I'll come back and take your capital someday, you'll see. You'll be held by barbarians. Oh, I'm killed here. Oh boy, now oh, we're getting pushed back. This is quite a struggle here. We're getting some kills. Oh, there went one of my units totally destroyed. Doesn't matter. We're going to continue to fight on and fight on to the last. Come on, guys. Hold them, hold them for a little while. Hold on. Oh, no. Arg! We're being smashed. Well, it was a good fight. I didn't expect to hold very long. This will probably be the end of my um, first turn coming up here in my uh, slave revolt. Um, yeah, kill. Yeah, the last of my men are going. Uh, too bad. Clear defeat. But we did knock off some of those R Roman cats. That was something. Our army was annihilated. See if we can get out of this one. And of course, boy, we are losing more battles. And there goes Tara. And these guys have to run away. And so ends my first real turn. Oh, isn't that nice? Hey, look at that, some prophet. That was from capturing that, uh, that was Damascus. And, um, Merwin Tara, of course. Oh, good, that was, that's good. I don't mind that, to tell you the truth. Looks like we're gonna make a little tiny bit of money. Oh, boy. Let's go over here and take a look at our, um, capital. 
looks like there's not they didn't attack me over here. That's cool. You can see that I'm holding them off by putting just two units in front of them here. That keeps them from going through. Um, oh, here's some news for you. A little while ago, I went through some updates on my computer and thought I had lost all my all my um, Rome Total War files. Oh my God, do I flip out? Ah. <laughs> okay, we'll try to reinforce up here. Um, I don't see much else I can do here. I'm at war with everybody. This is horrible. This is a little bit more difficult, I do believe, um, than the um, Numidia campaign. Because you have no friends, and you can't make any friends, and you can't trade with anybody, and you cannot buy any generals, and your diplomats cannot do much for you, except maybe buy up loose armies. So this is really, really something here. I was hoping they would have grabbed this by now. Um, and this, this is too bad. These go, these, these cats. They never you know, right down here. This is just nah, too bad. Okay, well, I guess I'll group together here and try to hold this place for a while and um, see what we can do here. Okay, thanks for watching. I do believe this will be the end of um, turn one here. The um, Slave Revolt brought to you by Jim Avery. Uh, this was for fun. Uh, oh boy. <laughs> Okay, if I have anything to add to this, I'll uh, put it in here, but I do believe we're done. Okay, you guys have a good day and a good week and all that. Oh, boy. Oh, yeah. Uh, one more thing. I believe this is a, this campaign is maybe a bit tougher than Numidia. You have more enemies. No trade. Diplomats are no good. Um, why don't you guys try this for fun? little challenge to you out there. Anyway, just a thought. Take it easy. We'll see you soon. Uh, back to Numidia for me, for a while anyway. <laughs> Bye.